Hello, everybody. Lord Verminar, back again in my summer car. We have some serious work to do. We have some serious things to figure out here. So I use the editor, not to edit anything, but just to try to figure out where stuff is. The Gaifu is still there. Um, it's in town somewhere. I don't know where exactly. Uh, I mean, I saw where the marker was, but I didn't see like what part of town it was in. So we're going to go check that out at some point. Grandma's still alive. She called me just before I was to hit record. Um, and she wants fish. So I got to do that. Um, there's one sewage job. So I don't think I'm going to pick up the Gaifu, drive it all the way down here for one sewage job, and then drive it all the way back. That would absolutely not be worth it. So I think I'll wait until more calls for that come in. The hay bales. I'm, I'm missing, I think, four or five of them. Uh, and they are over here in this field... Um, actually over here, across the highway, um, near where Grandma's house is. So there's, I think, five more that I'm missing. And I don't even know if I can load five of them up in the tractor all at once. I don't know. Um, either way, that's, uh, that sucks. <laughs> so I don't know what to do, uh, what to do first here. I, I think... Uh, I don't know if I feel like dealing with Grandma right now. And I'm I'm not going to give her... I still have some fish in here. Speaking of that, I should probably eat one right now. Um, I'm not going to give her my fish. She's got... I got to get... I have to get her own fish, I guess. So... Um, and we're, and we're running pretty low on cash. We've only got 2,500 monies. Which isn't a lot of monies. So, uh... I think I want to try to get this hay bale job done because because that's money. I don't even know how much it's going to pay me. It's not going to be very much, but it's better than than nothing. So I guess I'm going to load up the old tractor and try to do these hay bale jobs. I'm not even sure if there's like a quick way I can get over there. I know that I can't go like straight at the end of my road. What am I doing? I'm walking the wrong way. I can't go straight at the end of my road like because there's a there's like an impasse there. But, um, I think I could go to Grandma's and then just, like, drive through her yard into the... across the street. That might be the safest way. Although, this is a weekend and the rally is happening, so... Uh, there's all that nonsense to deal with. This might be a really bad idea. Like, a really bad idea. Damn it, game. Why you gotta be hard? <laughs> um, I don't know. I don't know. Yeet. Okay. Whoa. Okay, that was cool. All right. <laughs> we'll pretend like that didn't happen. Let's just go. Let's see what we can do. Maybe we can make this happen. Um, maybe by the time I actually get the bales picked up, it'll be the the rally will be over for the day. Because it's already it's already afternoon, I think. So, um, for some reason, I have the parking brake doesn't trigger anymore from the seat, which I can't really figure out what's going on there. So, <laughs> so here we go. I'm sure this is probably going to end poorly, but we got to do it. Like I said, the the money is getting kind of kind of be a problem. And and I did check too the the drunk guy. Uh, I don't know what his name is. Jockey or something like that? I'm not sure. He's dead. <laughs> Someone was like, maybe he died when you crashed when you were driving, driving him home that one day. Even though he was still making noise. So I guess uh, I guess it was a bad enough accident that there were complications and now he's dead. So I cannot do the uh, kill you jobs anymore. And um, even before you had to like drink the stuff before you sold it to him, it was still the most profitable thing you could do in this game. So now the only thing I can do is the woodcutting jobs, which I have to wait until the guy calls me to, before I can do them. But those pay well. That's like three grand and it cost me nothing. Uh, and I, once I finish this job, the farmer has one more job for me and then that's it. And then... You know, I get a little bit from Grandma every now and then. 
and um, the rest is going to be the sewage jobs. So it's it's not going to be as easy to amass a fortune without being able to sell to that guy or get his. Um, more importantly, get his uh, his lottery winnings because that's a um, that's a thing you can do. We're just going to have to find out. I don't know what else to do. Just going to have to grind and uh, and make money however I can. Well, you can make money on the rally races too. But the car is not in rally competition state right now. Uh, yeah, there, goes a, there goes a rally car right there. So I'm trying to figure out how to get there from here. This is going to be tricky. I wish I wish I saw which way that car was going. All right, I'm gonna go this way and take a risk. The good thing is, if I get hit by a rally car, it probably won't kill me. I just have to worry about potentially flipping the tractor over, which I can flip it back upright with the uh, with the axe of the beer case trick. Okay, it looks like they're gonna be coming towards me. Unless that's the way that the car that went past just went. I don't know. I guess we'll find out if I get, like, freaking slammed in the back. We'll know that it's because a car was coming behind me. I don't see any coming towards me yet. Trying to keep like one eye, one eye in front of me and one eye on the rearview mirror here. All right, cool. We made it this far. All right, now we got to get across the highway. We got to get through this ditch. There we go. All right. Made it through there. There's probably a way around that. I'm not sure. Those ditches are really annoying in the game. All right, now we got to get across the highway here. All right, here we go. Excellent. And so now these bales are over here someplace. Thankfully, I can drive through the fields as much as I want, and that doesn't bother the tractor too much, so... We can do that. Those bales aren't in this barn, are they? That would be a silly place for them. <laughs> I'm pretty sure this is where you have to pick up the, uh... Um... Maybe it's not over here. I can't remember. I'm not seeing any bales anywhere, though. Are you? You don't suppose they're in this barn, do you? Well, I guess we can... I guess we can find out real quick-like. Yeah, for some reason the parking brake isn't accessible from the seat anymore, and it's really upsetting. Okay. <laughs> okay. Thought I thought I lost my uh, case in that bump over there. That's not working. Well, they're not in here anyway. Okay, I didn't need to do that. Well, come on, get up in there. I guess we'll keep looking. I mean, they were on the map. They the it showed them over here. So oh, I can break. Yep, got to lean into it this time, I guess.
And I'm, I was pretty positive that they were across the road. Whoa! Okay. What sucks is I think there's more than I can carry. Oh my god. There's more than I can carry over here. Oh god, this is quite rough. Aha, there they are. Well, I'll be dipped. Ah, uh, good grief. Alright, well, nothing to do but to do it. Let's see. I think it would probably make sense to keep myself aimed this direction. Because the road to go back... Uh... The road to go back, um... Onto the, the gravel is like right over there, so... Alright, we're rolling. Clean. There we go. All right, so let's see if we can do this without causing a massive, um, a massive problem. Let's drink one for luck here. And we want to, uh, equip this. There's the bus. All right, here we go. Every time I do this, it's a pain to do it this way. Like, and I think, imagine doing this the intended way. It just, it doesn't even like seem like a possibility anymore, to be honest. It's just like, it's so, it's just so bad. Now, the, the, the real challenge is going to be trying to figure out how to fit them all in here. I think if you stand them up on end, they will all fit. But I don't know how to do that without causing a massive situation here. And I'm certainly not fitting... What is that? There's five. Yeah, there's five of them. I don't know if I can fit five of them that way. We will, we will do our best. That's all I can do. And then I gotta get them, I gotta get them all the way to the frickin' farm. And I was thinking, oh, I could just leave the tractor in town afterwards and drive the Gaifu back home, but I still, I'm, I'm gonna need the tractor to do the, the firewood jobs, too. And that guy only calls you, like, once a, once every couple of weeks, in, like, in-game weeks, I think. It's not enough. It's... Not as much as I wish that he would. I wish he could do that job for other people. <sighs> of course, my phone is blowing up as soon as I start doing this. It seems to happen every single time. Okay. Whoops. All right. Duck down. Get underneath it. Lift and and we're on. Yeah, it starts to freak out a little when you when you push the bales around inside here too. It look looks like all I'm gonna get is four. So I really think I need to try to like stand these up on end here. Oh god. Hey, look at that. It's almost like I meant to do it that way. Okay, carefully. There you go, this way. As far as you'll go. And now I'll scooch that way. Now we will shove you back in there. There we go. Just there. Look at that. Okay. 
Now, I think they will all fit this way. Yeah, that's... Those are jammed all the way up as far as they'll go, pretty much. So, if I can get the rest of them in there that way, I think we'll be good. Well, the rest of them, these three. Yeah, I don't know. It's going to be tight. <laughs> I don't know if I can do it. At one time, I, I could have sworn before the game was patched, like back in the day, I'm, I'm pretty sure I was able to get six in, in there at once, but I don't remember if, if I'm just making that up or if that actually happened. Ah, yes, what fun this is. What I want to try to do is uh, see if I can try to get one in this way. But it just like wants to, it just wants to flip over. Okay, here we go. So let's try to get underneath it. Oh crap, it fell on my head. All right. Get underneath. Lift. Nope. <sighs> yeah, I don't know if it's gonna work that way. I'm pretty sure it'll flip over if I if I don't like try to like get it to pivot. Pivot. <laughs> it's it's like not high enough or something. <sighs> <laughs> yeah, because now trying to get it to flip over here is, is not easy. Because it interacts with the... Nope, 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 nope. Because it interacts with the trailer like that and uh, and has a little bit of a wig out. All right. <sighs> Two more. Let's, let's do this. Come on. We definitely need to curse... In whatever language you want to curse in to uh, get this done here. Okay. Come on. This one's struggling a little bit here. Doesn't want to roll. I wonder if I can, like, flip it up into... Oh, that worked way better. Look at that. Maybe that's the play. That's the move right there. Let's see if I can do that again. So you turn it on its side. Okay. As you lift it. Come on. Yeah, I'm not looking forward to the next job that the farmer has too, where you got to come out here to one of these barns and and pick up the stupid uh, like the combine or harvester or something. I'm not sure I'm, what it is. Um, that's a pain in the butt because that thing sucks to drive. Look at that! All right, drop this. I think we definitely earned a, earned a beer after doing that. Okay. Now all I got to do is get it back to the farm. And we can uh, finally put a pin in this job. So I'm thinking... This is going to suck no matter what I do. There hasn't been any traffic today other than the bus. So I'm thinking if... If I go this way, get back on the road, and then just try to and just try to get there through the back road, and hope that I don't get killed by a rally car, that's probably the best solution. But the, the fact that there has been no traffic today is kind of weird.
All right, and can the tractor even pull this thing with five in there? Not very well. <laughs> I also really wish this had a, a mirror on the right side as well, so I could see if there's anybody behind me. Because we all know what happened last time I tried to drive on the highway with this. It did not end well. But like I said, I haven't seen any traffic other than the bus. So what I think I want to try and do is just stay on the road here. Because some of those hills, I'm not going to be able to do. And trying to dodge rally cars while going up those hills is not going to be... Uh, that's not going to be something in, in reality for me that I think we can do. So, this seems slightly less dangerous. <laughs> Whether, I don't know if that's actually going to be true or not. Yeah, I really wish there was a mirror on the right side so I could see if anybody was over there. If I have to bail, I would rather go that way than in the ditch because I could get stuck there and never come out. If you're in a slow vehicle in the in the right lane here, like like the Gaifu or the Hayasiko or something, uh, the other cars will just pass you. They won't like slam into the back of you. But if you're driving the tractor for some reason, they just like slam right into the back of you, which is a little bit annoying. Dare I try and shift? Yeah, here we go. Let's see what happens. All right, it's accelerating. That's good. There's this funny shop here, too. I can't remember what the heck that is. Making our way as best as we can here. Hoping that I don't have to just like take an emergency dive. The lack of traffic is a little bit eerie. Maybe everybody's watching the rally? <laughs> Come on, tractor, let's go! Aha, here comes the bus. All right. Let's hope we don't get belted from behind here. 
All right, we're fine. Back into the lane. Excellent. All right, zero deaths. That's weird. The only car I've seen on the road today is the bus. Not that I'm complaining. Sorry if this is like making people weird, but I'm trying to be able to see. I can't see around the, the cab corner there. Alright, can I, can I light a smoke while I'm doing this? Okay. My stress is a little high. <laughs> oh crap, I got a downshift. Uh, Alright. There we go. I guess while I'm in town, I should probably fuel this thing up, too. I'm only at half a, half a tank, but... I suppose it's not really necessary. Okay, here we go. So this is the intersection to... Like, the where Flutari's is. But again, I kind of want to bypass some of those big hills, especially with the rally cars. So, um, I'm going to just keep trucking this way, I guess. This is kind of a long way around, but, uh, yeah, I don't know. There's that one really big hill right there by the mansion. And then there's those those two other ones, um, like where the dance hall is, and uh, yeah, that other one, the other one right past it. Look at this dude just walking across the street. It's a good way to get flattened, buddy. All right, this is uphill, so this is gonna suck. Oh my god, guys, can you believe actually getting this job done? Like, holy moly. Also, I'm curious if it would have been maybe quicker to go the other direction on the highway. I don't know distance-wise if there's... what the difference is, because originally I wanted to go this way so I could, um... just hop on the... hop on the back road there, but... After realizing how poorly this thing is carrying this load, uh, I don't think that would have been a good idea. <sighs> well, anyways, how's everybody doing now that I have time to, like, actually... <laughs> I'm not concentrating so hard. Hope everybody is having a fantabulous day. I'm doing all right, as usual. Spent most of the weekend working on the car, and surprisingly, I'm not too sore from it either. I was expecting to be more sore than I am. So that's a good thing, I guess. Got a lot done. Job's not done yet, but it's, uh... It's getting there. And then as soon as we're done with all this junk with this car, then we're going to sell it. Since we got the Q5. We don't need the old A3 anymore. And honestly, I'll be glad to see it go, because I am tired of working on it. And then I think what I'm probably going to do is sell the Beetle after that as well. Um, it needs a little bit of work as well, but not nearly as much. Just it needs a couple of little things before it would be in con any condition that I'd want to sell it in, you know? Um, and then I think what I want to do is try and get my GTI back up to snuff and use that as my daily driver. 
Oh, the freaking cops, are you kidding me? Do I have to stop? Oh my god. Really? Really, guys? This is ridiculous. Can I just pull that and not shut it off? That's why there's no people out here. Kato, Kesselin perään nassikka saanut murropaketista ajokortti. Kerrottiinko siinä paketin takana, miten puhaluskokeessa toimii? I'm trying to. It's not letting me. Oh, there we go. Että sellainen lukema tällä kertaa. Okay, whatever, buddy. Just keep doing your job, man. We appreciate it. Keeping keeping us safe in this uh, in this um, in this area. Yep. All right. Here we go. <sighs> Brother. All right, hopefully I can get out of here without running them over. Excuse me. I have hay bales to deliver. If you guys maybe want to stop traffic for me, that'd be great. Although it looks like maybe you already did. I don't know. Like I said, it's weird that there's no traffic right now, but I am absolutely not complaining. I'm just driving on the wrong side of the road, too, because I can't see. Alright, we're not too far from where we need to be. It's too bad that farmer doesn't have a, a, a back way. So I think his farm is probably somewhere right around here through those trees, but you can't get, get to it. Good times, good times. I often wondered what they were gonna do with this like big giant structure over here. It's weird that it doesn't serve any purpose in the game. Like I understand that, you know, from a realism perspective, it makes sense that if there's an agricultural area like this, there's gonna be like, you know, grain mills and stuff like that. It totally makes sense, but it's just weird that there's all this stuff created over there in the game and you don't do anything over there. Alright, looks like we got a downshift. Go tractor, go. I think we I think it would be a good idea to refuel this thing too because it's uh it's a little low. I'm using a lot of fuel burning up a lot of fuel here like in third gear just buzzing down the highway at like full load. Try fourth, maybe. Now I'm still gonna have to try to. I'm still gonna have to drive through some of the rally nonsense to get to the farm. 
Uh, so that's going to be a challenge as well. And I'm not really worried about crashing in anything. I'm just worried about dumping all my bales. I'm having to load them back up again. This no traffic thing really is kind of weirding me out. I swear I didn't like turn off the traffic with a mod or something, I promise. <laughs> All right, we're almost there, guys. Well, we're almost a town. And I gotta drive this tractor. Is that the bus again? Yeah, it sure is. And we gotta, uh, drive this tractor through town and turn it around in the... in Timos without, um, running into something. Excellent. All right. All right, don't dump them out. Let's go. I'm hoping that maybe I can get lucky and that um, the rally's done. I don't know what time they stop. I don't even know what time it is. Timos might not even be open. All right, here we go. Just gas this thing up while I'm here, I suppose. That seems like a good spot. Shut her down. I could pull the parking brake that time. Awesome. All right. Okay. I guess we'll find out if he's open here real fast. All right. Hopefully my pee is not going into the gas tank. <laughs> oh, still got more. All right, there we go. We're filling and draining at the same time. I pride myself on efficiency, after all. All right. Let me just... There we go. All right. Uh, can I grab me a beer out of here? Perfect. Now that I'm past the cops, I can drink as much as I want. <laughs> oh, I gotta pay. Crap. Don't wanna make that mistake again. Uh-oh. How's the problem? Okay, there we go. Yeah, that's great, guys. Just, yeah, keep doing you over there. Alright. Whoop. Yeah, I think I've gotten lucky. I think the rally's done. So, here we go. <sighs> I'm done shopping, man. Just leave me alone. And cousin is not. Uh, is not out on the weekends, so I don't got to worry about him either. So I think we'll be, I think we'll be, uh, 
smooth sailing here to the farm. Yep, Latari's not there, so yeah, we're good. Awesome. All right. This won't be so bad. The worst part is going to be driving home in the dark, I guess. Which I've done that with the tractor many times, so... Yeah, we'll be good. All right. It's almost like I timed that perfectly on purpose. I did not. <laughs> this, is, this is total luck here. I'm glad I went the, the, the highway route. Especially since there wasn't any traffic for, for whatever reason. That definitely made it easier. I would have struggled on these hills and then I would have gotten hit by rally cars and it would have been a whole thing. Now I just, all I gotta do, the, the trickiest part I gotta do now is get back to the farmer without killing him. Don't want to accidentally run him over. Or have him walk into the tractor and die. That happened, that's happened to me before. Here we go. Where's he at? I don't immediately see him. I think at some point he goes he goes inside. Oh, there he is right there. Okay. All right. I need to turn this thing around here and he's walking right where I need to be. No, don't come this way. No. Oh God, please don't. Oh, thank God. <laughs> oh my God, I thought I was gonna lose it right there. Thought that was the end of it. I'm like, oh crap, he's dead. <laughs> don't come this way, just stay over there. All right, we need to a little backup cam action here. Okay. Uh, put that in neutral. Turn that off. Pull that. Yank that. Hit that, jump out of here. Okay. Excellent. Alright, so there's our case, and here's the axe. We need to collect and equip. Alright, now, this is a fun part, getting this stuff out of here without freaking out. I wish I could just dump them out of the, of the tractor, but it doesn't let you do that anymore. fine. Don't worry about that. Okay. Shove all these over here. One more bale to get. Oh my god, we're done. We're done with this stupid job. Holy crap, guys. Here. Remove that. Chuck that in there. Uh-oh. It's freaking out. It's freaking out. I broke it. Okay. There we go. Just chill. What is that weird noise I'm hearing? Okay. Are you going to pay me now? Pay me? 
Yes. 3,500. Oh. Sweet, sweet money. Okay. Wow. We did it. We actually freaking did it, guys. Can you believe it? We did the freaking bail job. Oh my god. It's only been... Jeez, when did I even start playing this game? This series? Like, holy crap. It's been so long. At the beginning, I was like, yeah, I'll try to knock out the bail job early. Yeah, that was like... That was like six months ago. <laughs> Here we go. Oh, God. Let's get the hell out of here. I still don't want to run him over because there's another job that he's he's going to give me. Oh my god. Now I gotta make the long trip home. But it's not so bad that it's not completely weighted down now. The only thing I got in there is a case of beer this time. And an axe. And there's no traffic to worry about. So I, I, if, I if I wreck or something crazy happens, it's my own damn fault. <laughs> yes! Oh my god. It feels so good to accomplish something in this game. <laughs> Holy moly. Ugh. Such a struggle, man. Such a struggle. This game is not for the faint of heart. I tell you what. It is a little bit brutal. But I, I kind of like that about it, you know? Like, nothing is easy. And and so, I, I, I didn't even, like, load those bales up the right way, right? I was still cheesing the game, doing it with the, the freaking uh, beer case and the axe. Ugh. All for 3,500 measly bucks. That's okay. That's going to get me, uh, it's going to get me a few more race car parts. But keep in mind, too, that the Satsuma is completely rebuilt. I didn't bother to put it together. Uh, for those who haven't watched the whole series, um, first of all, go back and watch it. But second of all, uh, I earned as much money as I could at the beginning of the game to buy all new parts for the Satsuma. So everything on that car is new. Um, so, so that's why it's not together complete. Well, it is m pretty much completely together now, but, uh, it's not, um, that's why I'm not driving it because everything on it's new. And that's kind of why I'm in the money situation that I'm in right now. Which is probably not, usually the way that I play this game is that I, that I put the Satsuma together as quick as I can, because, I mean... It's even a while before you get the, um... The Hayosiko, right? So, uh... So, yeah. Then, so then you have a have some kind of car to drive, and you can do the... The jobs for Grandma, where you can drive her around and all that stuff. Um... So... Yeah, I didn't do that this time. I did get the Rusco fairly early, though, which is something I usually don't do. So that felt kind of good. All right, let's try not to crash on this bridge. That would be a good thing. All right, we're good. We don't have a a, a Gaifu flip round two here with the tractor. I still need to find that car, but or find the Gaifu. But I'm pretty sure that uh, that's not going to happen this episode. I think we can find it. We'll be all right. I I don't want to do that on the weekend either. That's kind of a pain to deal with the rally cars and stuff. We will just do it later. And like I said, I'd, I'd rather have some of the sewage jobs lined up before I pick it up again. 
I'm also trying to remember how full the tank was when it flipped over. So if I'm going to have to do that again after I pick it up, or I can't remember. This is a nice relaxing drive back when you don't have to worry about cars. Of any kind, whether it's Cousin or the rally cars or anything. Right? It's not... Uh oh. No! No! Oh no! Holy crap. Am I dead? I'm not dead. How did that not kill me? Oh my goodness. <clears throat> okay. And here I was just saying the game was being really good to me today. And here we are. We got hit by a train. Let's see if we can fix this problem here. So I have my beer case. Um, where'd the axe go? And also, if the train comes again, um, it's gonna... It's gonna cause a problem here. Oh wait, maybe I can, maybe I can flip it without using the axe. Holy crap. That worked. Now, I don't know where the axe is, um, but first of all, let's get off the tracks before we go, before we do anything else. Oh my god, I don't know how that didn't kill me. I'm, I'm actually, like, dumbfounded. I, I heard it come in, like, right as it was too late. Wow. Okay. Yeah, I'll just leave it running, I guess. It doesn't really matter. Uh, take a look and see if I can find my axe. I don't know where the heck it would have ended up. Because that thing knocked me pretty far into the sky there. Jeez, who knows where it is? Oh, there it is right there. Look at that. Okay. All right. Well, no harm done. We got the beer back. We got the tractor flipped back over, and we got, um... We got the axe. I think, um, I think that deserves a beer. <laughs> or, or three or four or six. Wow. All right, let's go. Yeah, that was one of those situations where I was listening for it and I didn't hear it, so I kept going. And then I heard it. And I think it, it was too late to even... I think it was too late to try to go to either stop or go, you know? <laughs> it was like just at the right moment where there wasn't anything I could have done about it. So I just tried to power through. Not good. I mean, you could argue that I should just be more careful crossing the railroad tracks, but, you know, what fun is that? Alright, rest in peace, drunk guy. Sorry I killed you. <laughs> I needed your money. I don't suppose his, his lottery case still shows up after he's dead, even if um, he doesn't tell you about it first. Because that's the thing, too. He tells you about the... about how he won the lottery and he stuffed it in a case and hid it somewhere. And then you gotta find it. I think there's a, uh, a handful of spots where it spawns... where it could spawn. It's not just random, so... I just don't remember where they are. I've only done that one time.
And that's the good thing about driving the tractor, is a lot of times it seems like impacts that should kill you don't usually kill you. Because I know there's there's been a couple of times where I've run smack into Cousin before, too, and, uh, yeah, I was fine. Usually doesn't turn out so well for him, though. It is kind of weird that, like, your cousin can be killed. But sometimes, you know, he, like, drives off the road and wrecks or gets hit by the train or something like that. It's weird that he can be killed and then he just comes back the next time you load the game. But, like, uh, the drunk guy and her grandma and stuff like that, if they die, then they're just gone. Then there's your uncle. I don't even think he can die. I think the train just went by again, didn't it? it sounded like it. Yeah, one time, you know, sometimes your uncle's drunk at the pub. I've, like, thrown him in front of the bus before, and the bus just rolls over him. He's fine. <laughs> I'm invincible. So I guess it would be good to talk about, like, what my goals are for this game, too. Like, I, obviously I want to win a rally, right? That's like the... That's like the thing that everybody wants to do, but... I've never done any of the, like, quote-unquote end game content. You're supposed to go on a date with that girl. Um... I've never done that before, so... Uh, maybe we'll try and... we'll try and do that. I cannot believe we got the hay bales job done. That would have been horrible, though, to die. <laughs> Get hit by a train and die, like, right after we finish it. <laughs> oh, oh, no. Oh, my God. I got so lucky there. All right, let's put this stupid thing back where it belongs. All right. We're in reverse. Oh, that was the wrong way. Here we go. Yep, did that all wrong. All right, let's try that again here. All right, here we go. Doesn't have to be perfect, just in the vicinity, so it's easier to load this thing up with wood. All right, that's, that's fine, right there. Doesn't have to be perfect. Turn the lights off. Um, all the way off. I said all the way off, there we go. Do that, do that, do that, do that. And do this. Then we tip it over as we get out, as the usual. Put my axe back. Now, if that axe got lost, there's another one on the on the island. So it would have been like the worst thing. Not ideal, but not the worst. Hey, where am I at? I'm going the wrong way. Here, this way. Okay, wow. What an action-packed episode this was. 
We've, <laughs> we've moved five hay bales across town. Amazing. I cannot believe we got that done. I'm just like, I'm in, enthralled that we got that done. Like, just, I can't believe it. It's, just, it's like such a monumental task. Ah, okay. Still not hungry though. That that must be some good fish. <laughs> All right, so that's gonna do it here. You know what? I'm gonna go ahead and um, do this as soon as I figure out what button to push. All right. oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We gotta finish it during the day, of course. Mm. Excellent. All right. That is going to do it for me today. So thank you all so much for hanging out with me. I really appreciate it. I appreciate every view that I get. Uh, if you like the content, please leave a like. Uh, maybe a comment if you want. Uh, maybe a subscribe even if you're not subscribed. And I will see you all on the next episode. Take care, everyone. Bye.